right then. So first things first, set up. Mm -hmm. See the difference in your back on the right hand side of your left hand? That's before, that's your after, yeah? yeah, Massive difference. Mm -hmm. Static changes are generally, pick your fingers, you've done it. Because you've just got to move your body in a different position. You can put a club there. It's doable, yeah? Might feel a little bit strange and a bit awkward to start with, okay? Now, we want the back to be nice and straight. We don't want to overly arch the back so you kind of S-spine, okay, and get sort of too much pressure on your lower back. It needs to be neutral, tilting forward, not pushing it too far back. If we start getting the back too much kind of this way, then you've got a lot of stress on your lower back. Just be careful, you don't see you going, okay, further, 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 yeah. and then you get too much. Again. Always just checking mirrors or to check that, okay? So, better posture there in terms of setup, okay? Now, before, with that slightly sort of hunched posture, you turn back to about here, okay? Then your body kind of stops, stops moving and, it's the arms. and then we yeah. collapse. You can see how close the club is now. It's all sort of hunched, your arms sort of hinge 90 degrees there. Very sort of powerless movement there, okay? Yeah. This one here now, shoulder keeps turning. Okay, get the top here now. Look at the golf club there now, okay? Club's further from your head, okay? A lot further back, so you're okay in terms of the movement, okay? You're making a bigger, more powerful turn, okay? Now, once you've got that hinge in the wrist there, this angle between your arm and the club, okay? Mm -hmm. This wrist hinge we discussed there now, okay? The key thing is to try and keep that angle as you come back down, okay? So as you start bringing the golf club back down here now, as you start coming down, you're keeping the angle. Now, the club's gone a little bit over this way slightly, which isn't a problem, okay? We discuss it, obviously, next time, whatever. But you've kept the angle. Your arm there is going to the ground. And the club now is still kind of up in the air. So you've got the club kind of here, yeah? Mm -hmm. As you come back to the golf ball, bringing the angle down, striking the golf ball, and then twisting through. Good shot. This one here now, when you're on the golf club this way, as you're getting back here, okay? Losing a bit more of the angle. Your arm now is sort of straightened and cast a little bit, Okay. As you come to the goal, because of that difference in contact, okay, you're right on the end of the goal club, as you can see there. The ball then sort of just scoots off to the right there. How much mm -hmm. that club's twisting as you hit yeah. it, okay? Big twist in that, that yeah. club face now at this point is actually aiming over there somewhere because the club bent in terms of the force on the golf ball with the, the strike, okay? And it's a lot of less power as you swing through. Not much of a twist with the golf ball, okay? But again, your body at setup was creating that limitation, yeah? If you're too far tucked under with your pelvis or you exaggerate the other way too much, your body can't move. So again, a good position with the posture. You can then make a fuller turn and then practice kind of pumping. So the lower half, the hips mainly, just kind of pull that, these hands down. Okay, Don't throw the club out. Just going to turn and hips down here, down this way. And then when you get good at doing this and out for me and out, okay, let it go. Yeah. Easy. That, easy <laughs> Just like that, yeah. But again, these positions at setup are a lot easier to make adjustments. So that kind of bump in there, as we can see, that's the move we're trying to practice there, okay, as you bring the golf club back down, okay? Yeah. But you can see when you've got a better posture there, I mean, yeah. those two positions there, the comparison of that to there is massive, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. The backswing changes are better, and the downswing changes are getting certainly better, but it takes a bit more practice because that's an instinctive movement, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Make sense? Make sense, yeah. Happy days, very good.